In our first video covering the various camouflage patterns utilized by German forces during the Second World War, we only covered those employed by the Wehrmacht. So today, as a second part to that video, we'll be taking a quick look at some of the camouflage patterns specifically designed for use by the elite Waffen SS. The first SS camouflage pattern we'll cover today is the plane tree pattern. This pattern, introduced in the late 1930s and produced until 1944, features a non-repetitive arrangement of irregular shapes and dots to disrupt the outline of the wearer. In addition, the plane tree camouflage pattern was produced in reversible form, with both a spring and autumn variation on each side. This would be a recurring characteristic in many SS camouflage patterns that would come about later on in the war. In 1940, a camouflage known to military collectors as the palm tree pattern was introduced to soldiers of the Waffen SS, primarily in the form of smocks. The palm tree pattern is best known for being mass distributed for the invasion of Russia during Operation Barbarossa in the summer of 1941. This pattern is quite unique in appearance, sporting disruptive shapes that are somewhat similar in likeness to the leaves of palm trees, hence the pattern's name. The production of palm tree camouflage was short-lived, however, ending only two years after its introduction. The next SS camouflage pattern we'll take a look at is the blurred edge pattern. This camouflage consists of an oak leaf based print along with additional shadow printing which gives the pattern both a blurry appearance and its name. Like the three previously covered patterns, the blurred edge pattern was also produced in reversible form, allowing soldiers to wear garments printed with the camouflage pattern year long and reducing logistical problems. From the base print of the Blurred Edge camouflage would come the standalone Oak Leaf A and B camouflage patterns. Production of these patterns would begin in 1941 and continue until 1945. The last German designed SS camouflage pattern we'll be taking a look at is the non reversible Dot 44 or P Dot pattern. This five color pattern, intended to replace all other Waffen SS camouflage patterns in use, saw notable implementation on winter garments, two piece uniforms, and even Fallschirmjäger jump smocks. Overall, the camouflage patterns utilized by the Waffen SS were some of, if not the best, camouflage patterns developed during World War II, and they were without a doubt ahead of their time. Before I end this video, however, it should be noted that some elements of the Waffen SS adopted foreign camouflage patterns, probably the most notable of which being the Italian M29 Telo Mimetico. Anyways, that's about all I got for today. As always, thanks for watching. Please consider liking this brief overview and subscribing to the channel to help us grow, and I'll see y'all in the next video.